Well, good morning, YouTube. All right, here it is, Thursday morning. This is what, day number seven of the Surgeon's Motorcycle Rally. And once again, we walk out this morning, three bikes in line, one more pulled up as we were getting them processed. So we're already, already on a wait, but I'm okay with that. Hi guys, and this is one of Katie's recent projects. She decided to create some inserts for our sandwich board help promote the channel and our business. So if you like it, tell us what you think in the comments. All right, guys, it is that time. And I know that this doesn't convey over video, but today is a beautiful day. The weather is uh, much cooler than it was the last couple of days. And as you can see with the flags behind me, once again, we've got a nice breeze. It's not windy. It's just a nice breeze. And uh, yeah, so we're working and we're not sweating, which makes it enjoyable. Uh, it's still a little bit early, so but there's a lot of people here. You can see there's at least a... Uh, uh, probably four or five hundred motorcycles parked out here so hopefully the day will turn out great check it out guys we got some unidentical twins here both bikes are 110th anniversary same exact paint scheme however this one's a road key and this one's an ultra pretty rare to see two up in the lift at the same time
Well guys, we got ourselves in the weeds a little bit. Things have slowed down and there was nothing on the lifts and then three customers came in wanting love jugs on their motorcycles. Uh, one of them husband and wife team, which were actually subscribers, which is pretty cool. And uh, so we got all three of those up there. And of course, wouldn't you know it, we got six oil changes coming in behind them. Now the love jugs do take a little bit longer to do than the average oil change. So that put us a little bit in the weeds, but all those love jugs are gone now. So I've got three bikes in line still and the lifts are full, all three, but we'll get caught up pretty quick at this point. Hey guys, check it out. Some more subscribers came by. This is Toby and Stacy. They just want to come by and say hi and be hi. a part of Bike Week. First time at Sturgis. From Fairfield, Pennsylvania. Hi guys, thanks for coming by. Check it out. Earlier we had the Road King and the Street Glide version. And now we've got the Road Glide version of that same motorcycle. Same paint scheme, same colors. Check it out, you know, we've been busy all day long and then we got a little bit of a lull and the guys each got to take about a five minute break. And then I thought, you know what? We've got the Chevy Duramax back here with a 6.6 uh, .6 in it. And uh, it belongs to Paul at the fairing exchange. And we've, for the last couple of years, we've been taking care of his oil changes for him. So he brought it over to me. I figured when we slowed down, we would go to get it taken care of. Well, we had that lull. So I, I got talent to start on it and we've got the oil drained. And all of a sudden we turn around and six more bikes come in. All three lifts are full. You see we got three of them sitting out there waiting. One of them's a love jug, the other five are oil changes. So busy, busy, busy. Just when we thought we had a break, they all come back in. Well guys, it's uh a little after eight o'clock now sun's starting to go down and it was a really busy day again i think we did a total of 32 oil changes plus the duramax back there so 33 if you want to count that and three or four sets of love jugs now one of the sets of love jugs we did not actually sell the customer already had them he had them on his old motorcycle and then he had purchased a new motorcycle and uh, decided he wanted to transfer them over, so he brought them to us, and so we did the installation for them. Uh, so it wasn't really a sale, but you know we did charge them for the installation. But other than that, it's been a really busy day. Now, I had intentions of uh, going over to the Harley dealer for a little bit today and trying to film some stuff over there so you can see what vendors are there. You know, my thought was, you know, I've walked around this vendor park for, you know, 10 days now, just about, and I wanted to try to give you guys some new footage. I mean, everyone seems to be liking what they're seeing here, but I didn't want to get too boring or too redundant. Um, but when we got that slow period, I was actually just getting ready to go. And then that's when all those bikes came in. So I just really couldn't do it because um, we had to stay here and work. So, and that's actually one of the downsides about what we do is, you know, we're at bike week, but we're not out running around partying at bike week. Um, you know, it's business where you're working. And uh, sometimes we don't get to go do the things we want to do because business is good. 
and uh, we just don't argue with that. So I think we're gonna go ahead and close this one out here. So thank you for uh, subscribing guys, I appreciate it. And those of you that came by to visit me, thank you very much. It was really great meeting all of you. And um, until the next time I see you, you guys keep those engines running.